I'm going to very quickly guide you through how to set up the Minecraft client on your PC, Mac, or Linux operating system so that you can access your NFT world and start exploring and building. The first thing we're going to want to do is go to minecraft.net in our browser. And this is the official Minecraft site. This is where you're going to get your Minecraft client so you can begin exploring your NFT world and building in it. We'll want to click Get Minecraft. You'll select Computer and you'll select Minecraft Java Edition. Right now, NFT Worlds only supports uh, accessibility through Minecraft Java Edition on uh, PC platforms, so that's Mac, uh, Windows, and Linux. You'll select Minecraft Java Edition, and you'll purchase it for roughly $27 if you don't already own it. Um, after you've purchased it, you'll have access to Minecraft on your computer. You'll want to launch Minecraft. So in a Mac, you would simply type Minecraft and hit enter. Um, I've already launched Minecraft on my computer. And once you've launched it, you should see a screen like this. What you'll need to do to access your world is hit single player, create new world. And you'll need to go to more world options down here. And you'll see there's this field. It says seed for the world generator. Each NFT world has a very specific and unique seed that is used to access your world. So we're going to go back to my world manager tab. Um, I'm gonna collect, select this world, world 703, and I'm going to copy this seed. What I'll do is I'll paste it into Minecraft here. I'll hit done, and I'll hit create new world. Uh, just a side note, you can set your world name here to whatever you want, but you have to make sure that the seed you enter in this field matches exactly to what your NFT world seed is. So let's create the world. And you'll see I open up in a forest, the starting point on this NFT world, number 703, you can see the center area is roughly a forest. If I were to explore, you would see that the terrain will exactly match what I'm seeing on my NFT world. And you can go from there, start exploring, start building, start playing in your world. Any changes that you make, as soon as we set up the update world feature, you'll be able to sync directly back to your NFT so that the world image reflects everything that you build within um, the 512 by 512 block area uh, from the starting point in your world. Uh, we'll also have multiplayer support too, so other people can come into your world as well. Um, and one last thing, we do have a texture and shader pack that we've used specifically with NFT Worlds. It will dramatically increase the graphics of the gameplay. If you really like smooth graphics, nice effects, shadows, etc., we recommend you install them. Um, if you want to install those, you can go on any Play World section and just scroll down and you'll see this Install Shaders and Texture Pack button, and that'll just bring you to a guide to do that for your computer. Alright, enjoy exploring your NFT world.